Good day viewers, you are welcome. How to solve this nice functional equations when we are given f of 1 divided by x equals x plus square root of 1 plus x and we want to find f of x given this particular function. So the first thing we consider here is the solution. So before solving this problem, we have to understand that here we have a domain in this function which is given as 1 divided by x. So we have to define the function very well before we can proceed solving this problem. First thing is the value of x here, they are member of member of real number. But not all these x in real number will satisfy the given function above. So that's how we have to define it very well. First thing is the x here is a member of real number but not equals to zero. So if x not equals to zero in these functions, we are good to go, but we have to consider this root as well. Here we have square root of one plus x, that is the number in this root must not be negative because we divide x based on the real number. So if x equals to all the positive real number, so we are good to go with this. But let's look at the negative part of the real number. Suppose we have x here equals minus 1. So when we take 1 minus 1, so this equals to 0, and square root of 0 equals to 0. So 1 minus 1 also satisfied. But when we check for minus 2, suppose x equals minus 2, we are going to have uh, 1 minus 2, and this gives us minus 1. The minus 1 in this root is not a real, so it's a complex. That is how we are going to neglect this minus 2. So we divide this that x equals to, x is a member of real number, not equals to 0, and not equals to the negative starting from minus 2 downward. Starting from minus 2 downward, but minus 1 is part of the, the value of x. So therefore, we start solving this by letting... If we let from the given functions, let's say we have 1 divided by x, we are going to apply substitution method. Let this one equals t. If this one equals to t, then we make t the subject of the formula. Suppose I divide this one by 1, then we cross multiply. By cross multiplying, we have xt equals 1. Then we are going to make the x here the subject of the formula by dividing both sides by t. When we divide both sides by t here, we cancel t, then we have the value of x here equals 1 divided by t. That is the value of x. So if x equals 1 divided by t, then we come back to the given question by replacing 1 over x with uh, with t and uh, we are going to replace every single x with 1 divided by t therefore we have We have f of t equals x is now 1 divided by t plus the square root of 1 plus 1 divided by t so when we proceed with this side, we have 1 divided by t plus here, when we find the LCM, we are going to have the square root of t, we multiply 1. That is t plus, then plus 1 divided by t. And looking at this side, we have the square root having numerator and uh, denominator. And when we have the square root of a divided by b, so this gives us the square root of a divided by the square root of b. So this is what we are going to have. And we don't want to have root as the denominator. We have to rationalize this. By rationalizing this, we have the square root of a multiplied by b divided by b. So this is what we are going to have. And by applying this one here, we are going to have f of t 
equals 1 divided by t plus the square root of if our b here is given as t and the whole of a is t plus 1 then we are going to have t plus 1 then multiply by t all divided by t so this is what we are going to have and by writing this one properly we have f of t equals 1 divided by t plus the square root of we write it first open bracket t plus 1 then divided by t so therefore we have f of t equals by taking one of this denominator and add this together we have 1 plus the square root of so t times t that gives us t squared then plus t times 1 that is t all divided by t so this is what we have for this as well but let's try and define the domain of this but before defining the domain let's replace t here with x because our intention is to find f of x not f of t but we have to replace this t the x with t just to get f of x because t and x they both member of real number so replacing this one with x we are going to have the solution as by replacing x here with t so x and t both are the same here as a member of real number therefore we have f of x equals 1 plus the square root of x squared plus x divided by x all right let's define the domain of this x for this root first thing is x here must not equal to zero when we have x equals to zero there is a big problem here then we are going to consider that x here is not equal to zero where x again is a member of real number but does it satisfy negative as well yes let's try and do that suppose we take at x here equals minus one for this we are going to have f of minus one equals one plus the square root of we are going to have minus one squared and that is one then here is minus one divided by minus one so this one work because one minus one equals to zero and we are going to get f of minus one is also equals to minus one and let's check for if x here equals minus 2 this is still going to work because when we have f of minus 2 this equals 1 plus the square root of since the first s is having minus uh, is having squared we are going to have it as minus 2 squared then minus 2 divided by minus 2 when we proceed with this we can see that at this side we have 1 plus the square root of minus 2 squared that is 4 and 4 minus 2 we have it as root 2 divided by minus 2 so this still work for f of minus 2 that is how it continues to all the negative and all the positive both of them they satisfy it is only when x equals to 0 that will cause a problem here that's how we have to neglect x which is not equals to 0 so this is how we solve these functional equations to this stage. Thanks for watching and if you have another method of solving this different from this, we can drop it in the comment box. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel, share this video and turn on the notification bell for more. See you in the next class. Never stop learning. Bye bye.